If you own real estate in Youngsville, then this month's market update is just for you. I'm Jim Cady with Cady Real Estate. In this month's real estate market update, we're bringing you nothing but the facts. I'm going to share with you the eight highlights about the housing market that are affecting your home's value, but I'm going to do it in 110 seconds or less. Now for the numbers. Youngsville reported 53 homes sold last month. This is down 32.9% from the previous month and down 39.8% compared to August 2021. The total sales volume last month was $18.3 million and that's down 26.4% compared to the prior month and it's down 31.2% year over year. 69 homes came onto the market in August, and that's down 27.5% from the previous month. There were 39 homes that went pending in August. This is down 82.1% from the previous month, but that represents 57% of all the new listings in August. The average amount of time a house stayed on the market in Youngsville was just 35 days, and that's down 25.7% from the previous month. The average sales price in August was $346,162. This is up 26.6% compared to August of last year. And the MLS reported 15.1% of the homes sold in August sold above list price. And that is down 15.1% compared to August of last year. But it's still double the average over the last decade. So why are buyers paying over list price while interest rates are rising and sales are slowing? It's still a seller's market and we will most likely continue to see sales above list price at least until supply outpaces the demand. We pride ourselves on being the expert advisors. So if you're thinking about moving up, moving down, moving away, or you just have a real estate question, let my team help put a real estate game plan together for you. If you want to stay ahead of the competition in this ever-changing market, stay tuned for more videos just like this. And thank you for trusting me as your source for accurate local real estate information.